Hey squad, we are going to do L-I-S-S -S today. It's low intensity, steady state. So listen to your body the whole time, you need to scale it down. But it's gonna be a cardio day, it's gonna be non-stop. There will be 32 exercises and each exercise you will do for 40 seconds. It's a low impact movement, but feel free uh, to take a break if you need to. But other than that, just try to stay with me from beginning to the end. So it's not meant to be high intensity. If your heart rate is elevated all the way off the roof, just slowly uh, I mean, scale back down. Let's get going. It's gonna include the warm up as well. So just follow me as much as you can. I hope you guys are ready. Okay, so from here, just bring your legs apart. We're just gonna take it nice and easy first. From here, I just want you guys to just run on the spot. Okay, let's go. Just run on the spot or march on the spot. Right, if you want, if you have a little bit of space, just feel free to run forward and run back. And just kinda loosen up. Get your body and mentally ready. Just tell yourself, you got this. <laughs> From beginning to the end. Remember the option, if you want to just march, march forward, march back. Especially if your muscles are aching from the other exercises, just kill it down. Just take a deep breath in and out. Okay, gotta keep on going. I'm gonna go knee lift after this. Right and left, just draw your knees in towards the chest. Okay, just pull it in. Both hands, grab your knees. Just pull it in close. Just kinda get your balance a little bit side to side. Pull it close. Inhale, exhale as you draw it up. Hug your knees. So gonna be 32 exercises. But we already, I mean, onto the second exercise. So just 30 more, only 30 more. Draw it close. Open up your arms as well. Open up your chest. Draw it in as much as you can. Onto the next one, leg curl. Just curl your legs, pull your arms to the side. Warming up the hamstring as well. And the shoulders. Elbows pull into the side. Breathe in and out. And turn. Not turn, just bring your body and lean to the side. All right, up and down. Shoulder starts to feel a little bit warm. Drawing close. All right, bring a heel to your bum. There you go. Okay, now you can slowly feel your heart rate coming up slightly. Onto the next one, torso twist. Bend the knees, elbows up parallel to the floor. Turn your shoulders, warming up the obliques. Side to side, breathe in and out. Turn your shoulders, turn your torso. Squeeze, bend that knees. Yes, bring it up, up and down. Last few. Let's go 10 more seconds. Feel that squeeze as you twist. And we're gonna go right knee up and then left foot tap back. Right knee, tap back, follow me. Up, tap back, straight away. Right knee up, left foot back. A little bit of coordination at the same time. <laughs> up and tap back, up and tap back. All right, you can move your arms nice and free. So your body is continuously moving for this next 20 minutes. So try to stay with me. So this whole movement is so you're going for like a brisk walk or going for a nice easy run. But we are at home at the comfort of your own space. All right, switch over, left knee, tap back. All right, and of course, increasing the number of steps on your tracker, <laughs> if you have one. Let's bring it up, up and down. Up and down. Yes, all the way. Lift and tap back. And move your arms, bend the elbows if you can. So just try not to hang your arms down this way. So you want to try to work the whole body at the same time. Okay, onto the next 
up, seal jacks, but the side tap. So different variation, arms up, up and down. So bring your hands close, do a tap right and left, lift. Draw it up, reach up, nice and high. So straight up, try not to go, don't bend the elbows, lift up the whole time. So every exercise, 40 seconds of work. Okay, we're gonna go side shuffle with a leg lift. Right, move to the side and leg lift. Lift. Put your arms at the same time. Yeah. <laughs> so option. You don't have to kind of shuffle. You can do a double tap and lift your legs up. Draw your arms up at the same time. Put your arms nice and high. Yeah. Kind of like a shoulder press without the weight, of course. Bring it up. So your legs are moving. Your arms are working. V step, right and left. Follow me. Right left. Move your arms. Bend that knees. V step and tap back. As you come forward, soft knees on the front and stand up. So open your legs wide and bring it close. It's okay, you don't have to follow my pace. If you need to slow it down, go ahead. But of course, if you want to run forward and back, go ahead. <laughs> so decide whatever you feel best today. Forward and back. So after this, I'm gonna switch side. Ready, switch. Left, right. Okay, if you need some time to have that coordination first, we should to go first. Left and right. So you remember the option, run forward, run back, or you can just do a step forward and back. So you can even interchange the options in between, front and back. Okay, now, assess yourself. Are you going <sighs> really breathless? If you go with your heart rate off the roof, take a notch down. You can kind of going forward and back. All right, listen up. I'm gonna go skater to the side. Step and move your arms on the opposite side. Bending that knee, shifting. You see my torso kind of twist to the other side. Yes, yes. There you go. Open that step a little bit wider if you can. And move your arms. Soft knees on. When you go side to side, right and left. All right, listen up. Crease cross this way. Straight arms. Cross your foot to the front. So arms up, parallel to the floor. Woohoo! Okay. Now your body starts to feel a little bit more warmer than the first exercise, but it's all good. Reach your arms to the front. Cross your arms. So what we're doing now, basic steps, basic moves and working on aerobic and anaerobic threshold. Just try to stay on for that 40 seconds. Now listen up. Back tap, alternate right and left. Elbows bend, clench your feet, squeeze the back arm. All right, just keep on going. And the you guys. Lean forward slightly. Extend your arms fully. All the way, bend your front knee slightly. Raise that core. Don't run. Start to roll your back. Lift that chest up. Nice and strong. And give it a nice tap. Now keep your legs wide. Four punch. Four punch down. Four punch up. Four punch down. So not this way. <laughs> Turn your torso, move your shoulders, and bend that knee. Woohoo! 
Let's get going, everybody. A little bit hot on the punch. Punch up, punch down. Remember, draw it down, draw it up. Four times, up and down. Now, from you're gonna run to the spot, speed back. Clench your fist, move that arm. We get a little bit confused, march on the spot and just speed back. Circle your arms up, bring it up, don't bring your arms down. So it's a whole lot of movement from your arms to your legs. Woohoo! Move that feet. Circle your arms to the front. Be careful of your face. <laughs> Alright, after this, gonna do a side tap. Punch down, reach down. Tap to the side, punch it down. Yeah. <laughs> So side tap, draw your hands down, tap your toes to the side, right and left. Just turn your body at the same time. Let's keep on going guys. Alright, remember you can scale down if you need to. Even if you go this way, like coach, I'm getting breathless, but you're still moving. On to the next one, heel tap, push your arms to the front, chest press forward. Okay, option one, option two, sleeve your legs up. Elbows bend, squeeze. See, I'm stopping this red. <laughs> push your arms forward and back. Let's keep moving. Draw it in and out. So I mentioned to you, the basic steps, just 40 seconds. And just keep on moving. So your, your arms, your legs go in different direction. Now we're gonna go leg curl. Curl your arms. So like you did the leg curl just now in the beginning, but this time just switch up the arms. Curl your arms. <laughs> I know this is this kind of thick. Probably take you back like the aerobics era. <laughs> But it works on your cardiovascular. It gets the heart rate going. All the way. Pull your arms in. Move in and out. Move your body side to side. Move that arms. After this, we're gonna go on to a high smack. So just remember three, two, lift. Right, ready? Three, two, lift. Three, two, lift. So this is called a high smack. The inside leg. <laughs> Don't go the outside leg because I see many variations of this. <laughs> if you're one of them, I see you. <laughs> Alright, remember the option. If you don't want to go too fast, you can go two step and then lift. So this is called a high man. Draw it up. Ten more seconds. Okay, now both arms up. Here, chop to the right. Lift your right heel up. Chop, lift your left heel up. Bring it up, chop it down. Just imagine you're holding an axe. Here. Slam it down. Turn your body, turn your shoulders. Turn your hip. If you're feeling a little bit, you know, Stressed out on your day to day, use this chance to kind of let it go. <laughs> now we're gonna switch both arms to the right, to the left, chop it down, slam it down, a little bit harder. Turn your body as you chop, so not this way, bring it down. 45 degrees, diagonal down. Almost there. Keep the arms nice and strong. 
Now, horizontal chop. Watch. Arms parallel to the floor. And you see my legs? Cross back. Follow the direction of your legs. Don't worry, it will take you some time. Don't worry if you need to coordinate a bit of time. <laughs> so turn your body. Cross your leg back. Okay, keep on going. Watch, I'm going to show you from the side. Leap right foot, run back. Leap right foot, and come back. Just imagine there's a puddle of water re reaching forward. Run back. Kind of train a little bit of your spring. Spring of your legs. So this applies on the day-to-day -day life. If you see puddles of water or something you don't want to, you do not want to step. So you are trained for it. <laughs> so the next time when you see, just leap. Remember option? You don't want to run. March back. Switch. Leap left foot. Run it back. Okay, just keep on going. I'm going to go this side. See, the sweat gets into my eyes. <laughs> All the way. Let's get going, everybody. Almost there. Slip a little bit further if you can. Cushion that landing. Heel. Touch your heel. Hands up. Alright. Side to side. Right and left. Move that arms. Open up that knees. Everybody doing okay so far? This is exercise number 25. Let's get going. Move that arms. Don't drop the arms. If you start to do this, it's okay. And if you feel like, coach, you can go a little bit more. Arms up. Pull down. Oh, there are five more seconds. Next up, kick, step, step. So kick and kick. Walk, walk. Right, left. Follow me. Keep on going. I'm going to show you from the side. So it's a kick, step, step, everyone. Option, you don't have to kick high. Just can kick low. Get that momentum going. All right, move that arms. Stay with me. Got last few, okay? Last few exercises. Now, three pulse. Three, two, one. One tap. Three, two, one. So, not exactly a jump. It's a bounce. Remember the option? You can just leave that heels up and bending that knees. But if your body allows you, go a little bit higher. Tap, two, two, one. Let's get going. Move your body, turn that shoulder. All right, listen up. Right knee, three times. And one kick. Yeah. Three, two, one, kick. All right, just kick low or kick high. So three times, you can kick low or kick high. Bend and uncurl your legs. Yeah. <laughs> all right, shifting all your weight onto one side. Bring it up. Three times. Exhale. We got the other side. Ready? Let's switch the other leg. Three times. One kick. Woo! Remember the option? We get too much. Tap without the lift. 
left, lift, tap. <laughs> but we're almost there. Just remember to breathe. Don't bite your lip. Don't hold your breath. Last five seconds. Now, feet together. Touch your knees. Tap. But you see my arms up. Reach your arms up nice and high. So kind of a mini squat, but you're touching your knees. So how you want to intensify this, you can go much faster or you can take your time. All right, after this, we just left two more, two more exercises. So stay with me. All right, keep your legs wide. Punch, cross punch to the side, diagonal. All the way. Diagonal to the side. Punch it out. Straight punch. You can wipe your sweat at the same time. It's like me. Right and left. Straight punch. Push and pull. Yes. Turn your body. Bend your knees. After this, it's your last one. So try to stay with me. Maintain at this position. I'm gonna run on the spot and punch, one punch. Okay, everyone, this will be your last one. Option, you can march and move your arms. We got this, we got this. To the end, to the end. Okay, listen up. When I see last 10 seconds, I want you to try to go as fast as you can, okay? Not done yet. <laughs> move that arms up, drop the arms. Okay, ready? Just 10 seconds. Let's go. Pick up the pace. Woohoo! Draw it up. Push it up. Woo! All right, everybody. <laughs> Walk around if you need to. Just take a deep breath in and out. I mean, I'm sweating. I'm walking it. I hope you guys feel it too. Just take a deep breath in. <sighs> All right, one more time. All right, stay with me. We're gonna do a quick pull down. Grab the right ankle and point the knees out. If you need a sip of water, you can pause the video and then just grab water and then come back. Let's hold it here. Whoop. Switch over the other side. The leg, hold it there. How are you guys doing? Are you guys, are you guys doing great? Now from your interlace your hands around your back. And just pump this thing in. And interlace our hands to the back. The longer the arms, open up that chest. And release right arm up and to the side. And stay here. And switch over. And slowly release. Now just one arm crossed over. All right, just walk it out. If your heart rate is still up off the roof, try not to sit down, especially if your heart rate is high. Just still walk it out. And switch over the other side. But well done, guys. All right, you guys maintain at this time. I mean, from beginning to the end. And slowly from your white leg, bend both knees. One shoulder down, just look to the right side. And switching over the other side. And slowly coming back. Everybody just take three deep breaths in. Inhale. And exhale out. All right, we learn how to get the heart rate up, but we must learn how to get the heart rate up. Inhale and exhale out. And one more time, just feel great. Interlace your hands, just feel good. And just acknowledge that you did it from beginning to the end, whatever you're feeling from the start, but you managed to complete it and conquer it. Exhale down, Woo! All right, good job, guys. I will see you guys on the next workout. <laughs>